something. You know, something is seriously wrong with the black women of this generation. 2019 generation of black women have really sunken to an all-time low. It's really sunken to an all-time low. And let me tell you something. This is that mental brainwashing. This is that, you know what I'm saying, this is that years and years of watching these damn movies and this years and years of listening to this, you know what I'm saying, so-called demonic music. This has come from years and years of abuse, mental abuse, that our black women has come and stooped to this type of low. You won't believe the video I just seen. Let me, let's go ahead and break this news, people. Let, let's go ahead and break this news. Start spreading the news. I woke up this morning. I know, you know, woke up one Sunday morning. You know, I woke up this morning to look across my news desk. You know, I got to get the news. Start spreading the news. You know, I got to spread the news. And when I woke up this morning, I said, looking at this news report, it says, Teen Mom. I don't know how she's a teen mom. You're 19 years old. You know what I'm saying? You should have some common sense enough to, you know what I'm saying, if this is a four-month-old baby. You 19 years old. You got common sense. But, you know what I'm saying, it says teen mom. You know what I'm saying? When, they, when it said teen mom, I thought it meant, you know what I'm saying, 15 years old mother or, 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 or 17 years, years old mother. You know what I'm saying? I thought it was something like that. But this woman is 19 years old. You know what I'm saying? And what did this 19-year-old woman do? This 19-year-old woman got on her. See, this is, this is the state of this generation of black women. They have been abused so much. You know what I'm saying? They have been, let me tell you, this is, this is years of mental abuse. Not physical abuse. No, ain't nobody, ain't nobody put their hands on these black women. But somebody put the words on these black women and psychologically destroyed their mental. Let me tell you something, people. So this woman got on her social media soapbox and, you know what I'm saying, and started confessing that she had been abusing her four-month-old child. Daughter, Cora. It's a four-month-old girl. So it's not a, it's not a boy, a four-month-old girl, you know what I'm saying, named Cora, C-O-R-A, I think it is. A four month old daughter Cora. She and let me say as she as she um confessing that she um abusing her is no crying. She's actually laughing. She's laughing about the whole situation of her pinching the four-month-old and slapping up the four-month-old and, you know what I'm saying, and tossing the four-month-old around. She's actually laughing about this. I'm telling you, people, it is a, let me tell you something, it is a psychological, you know what I'm saying, mind thing that our black women have went through. They've been abused so much. And let me tell you something, you may not believe it, but I blame it on you black women. You black women is the reason why you black women are in this predicament of a, of your mind. This is, you know what I'm saying? Because, let me tell you something, because you choose the wrong dudes, so the, these dudes that you choose play with your mind. And as these dudes that you choose play with your mind, that causes something within that woman. You know what I'm saying? Not just one, not just one relationship. You go from relationship to relationship to relationship, you know. Kind of like how I, you know what I'm saying, go from restaurant to restaurant to restaurant, you know. First I want to eat at Old Charlie's. Then I want to eat at, you know what I'm saying, uh, Red Robin. Then I want to eat at, you know what I'm saying, Outback. You know what I'm saying? How I go restaurant hopping is the same way these women go Negro hopping. 
And they're not looking for a good man to father their children. They're not looking for a good man to be with them and support them and and be a good husband in their life. They're looking just for a wham, bam, thank you, ma'am, and then get upset when that man is not in their life to take care of their children or then get upset when that man is not in their life. And going off and messing with other men. You choose. You chose this. You got to blame nobody but yourself black women. You chose this. And this is the end result to the black race. The black women race. This is the end result. You have so black women so destructive. That they do things like this to a four month old. And let me tell you something, people. You may not believe it because, see, you are you on the inside looking out. See, you're not on the outside looking in. If you was on the outside, you can see exactly what's wrong with this woman and all of the women that act like this. You you would know exactly because, see, let me tell you something. There's one thing when the Most High God wakes you up. The most, most high God wakes you up to see things like this. Like you can see things that, you know what I'm saying, other people just don't see. Like, you know what I'm saying, I, have, I might have a lot of people that come on the comment board and be like, Oh, you don't know what she's going through. Well, that's you on the inside looking out at me and you don't see what I see. You know, kind of like that song. You can't see what I can see. You're blind, baby. You're blind to the fact. You know how that song go. You can yeah, that's an old nineties song. You don't know about that song. Yeah, y'all better go and check that. You can't see what I can see. You're blind, baby. You're blind to the fact. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You you black women, you are a queens of this earth. But you acting like this, you know what I'm saying? You got to stop, you know what I'm saying? Raise up. And understand that, you know what I'm saying, not every man is for your best interest. Not every Negro is for your best interest. You guys got to choose wisely. Don't don't be selfish and just choose a man because he got good sideburns or, you know what I'm saying, because he look good, because he talk good game. You guys got to look at the future because, let me tell you something, when you lay with a man, you don't know, you know what I'm saying, if you're going to have a child with that man. Hey, you may lay with a man and the condom may break and you may get pregnant, so now you got a future generation in your belly. And you done had a future generation with a dude that is not worth two quarters to rub together. See, that's what you women, if you women are so-called want to be queens and want to be so-called, you know what I'm saying? Uh, oh, I'm, I'm a black queen. I can give, I'm special. I can give birth. So you, if you can give birth, you can give birth to next generation, next generationers. Then you should think for the next generation. Because every every woman needs a good man. Every man needs a good woman. You know what I'm saying? Stop listening to stop listening to these scallywag dudes. And you won't turn out like this. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? She's getting, this woman got on her soapbox social media platform confessing and laughing about abusing her four-month-old child. Confessing and laughing when really that laughing was really hurt. What influenced her to go on her soapbox? Because she wants to get back at the dude that hurt her. The father of that child that hurt her. The father of that child done did something to her. Done, you know what I'm saying? Done, didn't want to be with her. You know what I'm saying? Don't call her no more. Probably with some other chick. And doing more for the other chick than he's doing for her. And this is uh, another way to get back at that dude. Well, you can avoid that. Just stop picking these scallywag dudes. Keep your legs closed. Do the six months rule. 
You know what I'm saying? You meet a chick. I mean, you meet a dude. Guess what? You wait six months to a year. Don't give that man no snatch. Don't even give that man as far as a kiss. Put that man through the test. Put that man through the six months to a year test. And see if he can, you know what I'm saying, stand the test of time through six months to a year. Within six months to a year, that man will do something that you will see that that man is not worthy to get your snatch. You know what I'm saying? This, this is just a hurt woman. A hurt woman, a woman that has been hurt time and time again, and now her mental is so messed up that she does things like this because she's hurt. That's why she's doing this. She's doing this because she's hurt, people. You know what I'm saying? Some people, you know what I'm saying, react by, you know what I'm saying, breaking out their dude's car, breaking out the windows in their dude's car, you know what I'm saying, slashing their Negro's tires, you know what I'm saying, beating up the woman that they Negro was messing with, you know what I'm saying, some women does that, but, you know what I'm saying, this woman, you know what I'm saying, did this, this is just a hurt woman, and you don't have to be hurt, women, just stop choosing scallywag dudes, just choose righteous dudes. It's a, you know what I'm saying? You, you, this is 2019. Choose righteous dudes of the Lord. If you choose righteous dudes of the Lord, you won't have to go through this. You won't have to go through none of this. But anyway, I'm done with this. I'm over at my Facebook fan page. Um, I go over there, I go live over there every afternoon with a live show for you. More details, more information, more knowledge for you. Go on over there and hit that follow button. That's um, www.gospeltalk. TV.com. That's www.gospeltalktv.com. When you go over there, make sure you hit that follow button as I bring more shows to a computer screen near you. Also, I'm your host. I'm your pastor, Mr. Michael Smith. If you're new to this channel, please tap that subscribe button. Show your support. As I bring more shows to a computer screen near you, you can tap on that bell. You won't be notified when I go live with a new show. Hit that like button if you like this show. Hit that hate button if you hate this show. Hit that comment button. Leave a question or a comment on this show. Also, if you want to donate to this ministry, you're welcome to do so by clicking on the donation link in the description area of this show. Till next time, stay tuned. God bless you. Beans, greens, potatoes, tomatoes, chicken, turkey, rice, beans, greens, potatoes.